Alright guys, in this video I'll be teaching you guys how to upscale videos to 4K using FFmpeg. Just a quick disclaimer, you'll need an NVIDIA graphics card or AMD graphics card to do this. Enjoy the video! Alright, so the very first thing I want you guys to do is copy down these selections. But if you have a Mac OS or 32-bit version Windows, make sure to select these. And then just copy down these versions, linking, and license. After you do that, just go ahead and click download build. Alright, so once you download FFmpeg, it should be in a zip folder right here. So just drag it into your desktop first, and then it'll be right here. So after you do that, I want you guys to right click this file and click extract here. So if you do not have WinRAR, make sure to download WinRAR. All the links will be in the description so you can extract these files. So after you do that, just make sure to delete the zip file. So you only have this file left. After you do that, just drag this file into your C drive folder. Alright, so I dragged it into my C drive folder as you can see right here. And make sure to delete all the other like numbers and letters and just leave FFmpeg and right here. And then what I want you guys to click is the start menu. And then I want you guys to type edit the system environment variable. So it should show up right here. Let's go ahead and click that. And I'll drag it right here and click environment variables and then in the top menu just click path and then click edit after that just click new and then copy down this setting c colon backslash and then ffmpeg backslash bin bin backslash all right so this is very important so make sure you do it uh, correctly and if you don't have it in your c drive folder just make sure you change these so you guys uh, locate it where ffmpeg is so and then make sure to have bin too since it locates ffmpeg and inside the bin right here so after you guys do that just go ahead and click ok and ok but i'll just be deleting this since i already have it right here so i'm going to be deleting that and click ok click ok and just exit out of the system properties so after you guys do that just click users in your windows c drive folder and then click the user you use like most often so what you're using right now I only use administrator so I'm just gonna click that and then you guys can really choose any folder you guys want but I'd be choosing documents and then after you guys do that just go ahead and create a new folder and name it upscaling or anything you want upscales upscaling I don't really mind so after you do that I have it already created right here let's go ahead and open it all right so what you guys want to do is just right click this file click new click text document and then name it anything you would like, but I'm be naming it 4K, 4K Converter. All right, so now that you've done that, just click this, right click it, and click Edit. After you guys done that, just copy down this little code line. I will be pasting it on the description. So after you've done that, it should look like this. And then all you guys want to change right here is the file path. So what you guys want to do is click File right here. And then just click this empty space you can see right here and then just press ctrl c on your keyboard to copy it after you do that just select this file path and then paste it make sure to have a space between these so it actually works all right so if you have an nvidia graphics card you guys can just leave this and then i'll be teaching you guys what to do next but if you have an amd graphics card i want you guys to change this h.264 part to amf all right, so if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, just put it back to H.264. And then I want you guys to click File, Save As, and then just go to the upscaling folder you made, and then name it 4K Converter.bat. This is really important, so make sure to do it. And then just click Save, and then exit out of your notepad, and then it should make a converter right here. So now I'll be teaching guys how to actually use this. So I have this little test footage right here, Pexels Videos 3723. So I want you guys to just rename your video to convert and then it will only work if you rename the video to convert so make sure to do that. And then I want you guys to double click the 4k converter and then it should start converting. It should open up like the command prompt and then it will load a bit. So it will take a, uh, a bit if it's like a longer video but it should be quick if it's a short one. So then it will make a new file with the new footage called a uh, video and then that should be the 4k converted version. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I really hope you guys learned something new. Make sure to comment down below if you have any questions. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.